decided to drop a video on today and today is a very special day because it is our one year anniversary on YouTube! Yes! We've been on YouTube for a whole year already. That's insane. Our first video was literally uploaded today. So we figured we had to do a video for our one year anniversary. Right. Uh, we mentioned this in past videos before, but we have consistently uploaded since we've started the channel. Every literally. single week. And we've even dropped surprise videos in between those videos. So we decided for our one year anniversary video, we decided to do a little fun game of truth or dare. We hit you guys up on Instagram and Twitter asking for you to send us questions on truths and some dares that we can do in this video. And so we've chosen a few of our favorites. P.S. Sorry for the bags under my eyes. I just woke up. On Instagram, Lemon Lime, I dare you to tell everyone your most embarrassing thing you did in school. I have a lot of embarrassing stories, but one of the ones that whenever I think of embarrassing story during high school uh, that sticks out to me is, all right, this is really gross, so here we go. I got my car when I was 17. I was driving somewhere in Thousand Oaks, somewhere where I didn't have access to a bathroom anytime soon. I forget where. And I really had to pee. I really had to pee. And Chelsea knows, when I have to pee, I have to pee. There's no like, oh, she I can't hold it. I can't hold it. It's got, when it happens, it's time to happen. So I was like, shoot, what the hell am I gonna do? So I was looking around my backseat of my car, looking for something like, I'm one of those people that can totally maneuver and make it work in a cup, whatever. I find a Gatorade bottle, right? I decide, you know what? I'm gonna piss in this. It's yellow anyway. No one ever know. Like a lot of you guys who might have cars in high school, your car is your junkyard. So like, you just have a bunch of shit in the backseat, some of which are useful, some of which aren't useful. I grabbed the half drinking yellow Gatorade and I pissed in it. I made it work and pissed. I twisted the cap back on, threw it in the back of the seat. I was gonna grab it later. Of course, a couple weeks later, it's still in the back of my car, like a lot of things. And I'm once again on the road. I spend a lot of time in my car. I'm really, really thirsty. So I'm reaching in the back seat, trying to find anything, and long behold, I find a Gatorade bottle. I'm like, oh, I'll just take a quick sit, like swig of this. My mind is racing, I'm not thinking, I'm not remembering that I pissed in this thing two weeks prior. So I open the Gatorade, take a swig. <laughs> <laughs> Immediately realize it's my piss. I mean, it's not too embarrassing because it's something that happened between me, myself, and I, but uh, it happened. Oh my god. I don't even think she's heard this story before. I didn't know all of that. I mean, I knew you drank pee once, but like, oh, yeah. that's the story. Yeah, she's peed in a Gatorade bottle in my car before. She can pee anywhere. Yeah. That's like one of her superpowers. I don't really know how embarrassing this was, but trust me, it was embarrassing for me. I was in PE and our warm-ups were these Tybo tapes. You know the Tybo with the, the big guy and he's like, double time. The um, black guy. Yeah. yeah. And we were doing like these like Taekwondo kick things and uh, I was messing around with my friends and it was double time. And so like you're standing on your left leg and you have your right leg out kicking and you're kicking like as fast as you can. Well, I was trying to be funny and kick my friend in the butt and my footing got off and my left leg, my left knee went backwards and my knee went, my kneecap went out to the side. I lay down on the ground and I'm like, it hurts. And I look down and I see like the whole situation and I went into shock. And so they had to call 911, the ambulance had to come. I don't remember a whole lot. It was like the scariest thing in my life, but it was so embarrassing because it happened like in front of the entire gym class. Oh and they had to wheel me out in front of the entire school I had to be on like bed rest for a week and then when I came back to school like I don't know I just remember like I picked a spot in the lunchroom and I sat down and these girls were like we were sitting there and when I turned around and they saw my knee and that whole like contraption they were like oh my god you were the girl that got wheeled out in the ambulance huh don't worry about it you can stay and they left and I was like dude this is awesome that's insane <laughs> wow from Kai on Twitter they said, what is your favorite position and why? I'll let you answer this first, sexual Me? deviant. Your mom watches this. I know, you think I'm excited about <laughs> answering this question right now? That's why you gotta go first. Uh, mom, turn away, turn away. I know, Cynthia, we're giving you a five countdown to turn mom, around. Mom, you have five seconds. Four, three, two, two one. one. All right, no parents, here we go. Okay, uh, my favorite position, I like uh, being on top. My favorite position, from behind. She likes it from behind. Moving on! Anyway! <laughs> Do I look really washed out? No, it's... Look, I'm like completely... Like, sit back? Yeah. Look, I, I'm no, I see it. I'm the same color as the wall. Yeah, 
another truth from Winston Gray Saga. If you had never met, where do you think you would be? It's a good question. I would. That's... I was thinking about doing a whole video on this idea, so I might have to. But that's a great question. Uh. <laughs> you want to go? You... <laughs> I would be a wreck. Uh, I would probably be an alcoholic. I would probably be on drugs, and I might have been uh, pregnant. I'd be a tool. I'd be a douchebag. I'd be uh, a heartbreaker, I'd still cheat, I'd still, I would just be an asshole living in LA. Chelsea keeps me grounded. Without that, I don't know, I'd be an egomaniac. Brooke makes me want to do better. Easy right. peasy. From Linderix on Instagram, do your best Christian Grey impressions on your Anastasia. Hashtag 50 shades darker. All right, do I get to be Anastasia? You get to be Anastasia. Pin me up. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay, here we go. You ready for it? Oh my god! I need you to sign a contract. I don't want to sign! You have to. I just want to cuddle! You have to. Please just cuddle me! No one has ever oh. you the way that I you, and you're going to sign a contract! Ah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the worst Christian Grey impression ever. I think you rocked it. You got my shirt unbuttoned. From Barry Swirl fan page. <laughs> Pause! First of all, that's really freaking cool. Someone made a fan page for Chelsea and I. That's super dope, so I want to shout them out right here. I'm going to put their IG on the screen. Please be sure to go follow them. They're really awesome. I think that's super sick. Mm -hmm. Barry Swirl underscore fan page. It's cool. Allow Brooke to draw anything they want on your face. <laughs> that's fun. All right, thus, eyeliner. What should I draw, guys? All right, I'm going to just wing it. Is it a bunny rabbit? Yeah. Are those whiskers? Whiskers. He's got a nice long tail that I just drew on you. <sighs> Done. Is that it? That's it. Let me see. Bunny rabbit? It's a penis! So, all right guys, last one, here we go. Again, another one from Lemon Lime on Instagram. She says, I dare you to kiss the closest person. I think you gotta smooch a smooch of me. Mm -mm. Get that like. <laughs> All right, do I have black makeup on me now? Yep, she has black people makeup on her. Mm -hmm. Just like high school. <laughs> All right, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this Truth or Dare video. Uh, we had a lot of fun, so maybe we'll do a part two in the future. Please be sure to give this video a big fat thumbs up. Please comment below any questions that you want to include in a future Q&A in the comments below. Please be sure to click the subscribe button. Please be sure to turn on notifications, the little bell next to subscribe. Please be sure to follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. I am OMG Brooke Berry. I am OMG Chelsea Berry. And cheers to 2017, guys. We're going to continue to keep rocking. We're excited. So thank you for 6,000 subscribers. We're soon going to be at 7,000 subscribers, and we hope to keep bringing you videos. Yeah! Yes! Bye! Bye!